As an undergraduate computer science student, I opted to get the HP laptops provided by my school at the start of each academic year. In retrospect, this was a huge mistake. The laptop had a very slow processor, a washed out display, a mechanical hard drive, and less memory than my phone at the time. As a result, I couldn't complete the half the tasks required by my curriculum on this device. The only thing I could somewhat do on this device was web development, but that's not saying much since you can do web development on almost any modern smartphone. Luckily, the computer science labs were always open, so I could always use the equipment to complete my work and save everything on a USB stick. If you are a CS student trying to pick the right device for your studies, this video is designed to help you avoid making the same mistakes I made. First things first, don't consider buying a Chromebook or a Windows tablet because these devices are designed for browsing the internet and editing text documents. If your CS curriculum is decent, you'll be doing way more than word processing. Many schools provide laptops for their students. If yours does, please make sure that the laptop meets the following minimum requirements before accepting it, especially if you are paying for it. If it's free, then take it. Free stuff is always great. It might end up being e-waste, but hey, it's free. If you are buying your own laptop, yeah, are my recommendations. As a student, I'm assuming that you'll be carrying your device with you to most of your classes. For that reason, this list is focused on laptops and not desktops. Please aim for the following minimum requirements. An Intel i5 processor or better, 8GB of RAM, upgradable if possible, at least 500GB SSD storage, and a 1080p display. A laptop with these specs will allow you to do tasks like app development, 3D modeling, game development, data visualization, etc. without any issues. If you plan on doing game development, video, content creation, or even playing games, a dedicated graphics card will help. Here are some consumer-grade laptops that I recommend. The HP Victors, the Dell Inspiron 3000 series, Dell Vostro 5000 series, the Acer Nitro 5, the HP Pro Book or Elite Book, or the MSI Modern 14 and 15. Expect to pay around 800 to 1000 USD or at least 12,000 for one of these. If you do have the budget, don't ship out. This is the device that your life is going to revolve around for the next 3 to 4 years. If you get a bad one, you will have to spend more time fighting your laptop than getting work done. If money is tight, consider buying a used business grade laptop. These are very durable and reliable, provided that they are in good condition and are from the 8th generation or newer. Great options include Lenovo ThinkPads, Dell Latitudes, and HP Elite Books and Pro Books. For those of you in Cape Town, I recommend visiting Cash Converters Claremont. Their in-house technicians test each device for quality so you know that you are getting something reliable. If you are anywhere else, you can order from their website online. They do deliver nationwide. If you do decide to drop by Claremont, then let them know I sent you. With that said, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.